Hello my wonderful and amiable listeners, welcome to another news, it's a news headline, Alaba market demolition, bring investment, bring your investment from southeast, northern Nigeria to southeast, Ibob tells Igbos in Lagos, the news in details. The indigenous people of Biafra has asked the people of southeast Nigeria, also known as the Igbos, living and doing business in Lagos states and other parts of the western and northern Nigeria to return all their investments and businesses to the southeast to avoid destruction. A call, a call by the indigenous people of Biafra came amid the ongoing demolition of shows and at the popular Alaba International Market by Lagos state government. It was reported our leaders of the markets located in Ojo local government area of Lagos State accused the governor of Lagos State, Babajide Somolu, administration of demolishing their buildings in the market. They accused the state government of planning to make to take the market from them and hand it over to some Chinese investors who reportedly wanted to establish a multi-purpose market. Alaba International Market is established to be dominated by people of Igbo extraction reacting to the demolition exercise on Tuesday in a statement by its media and public secretary indigenous people of Biafra said it has been calling on people Igbo people living abroad to come back to the southeast and invest it also called on Igbo people in the western and northern region of Nigeria to take their investments to Igbo land to avoid destruction. While sympathizing with those whose business and properties have been destroyed in the ongoing demolition in Lagos State, indigenous people of Biafra said Igbo people living in Lagos State are currently victims of ethnic profiling and prejudice, and the Igbos have been victims of human and economic destruction from fellow Nigerians right from the amalgamation of the three major nations into Nigeria by Britain up to today. We came to understand that we are removing those buildings wrongly built on top of canal but following the hatred Yoruba politicians had against Indigo. Our people must be prepared because they will come for other buildings within the market. The indigenous people of Biafra call on our people to be ready. They are coming and they will regret their actions very soon. During and after the 2023 presidential election in Nigeria, Igbos in, Igbos in Yoruba land have been targeted for annihilation and economic sabotage due to political bigotry. The ongoing destruction of major businesses places of Indigo like portions of Alaba International Market is one of their planned strategies to put a lot of Igbo hardworking youth into poverty. We are calling on Indigo in Lagos State and throughout the northern part of Nigeria to return home and build shopping malls modern markets, supermarkets and plazas in Biafra land. On the other hand, we encourage our people to begin large-scale farming of Igbo stample food. We have developed a buoyant economic region before Nigerian government imposed their devastating economic policies that forced a lot of Biafrans out of the southeast. It is time for us to think home. Nothing will happen to us. We must succeed because God Almighty, Chuko Kika, Okike, Abiyama is always on our side and anywhere we go. Lagos is not Biafra land. If you are, if you are told to leave Lagos, do that, do that with all pleasure. We have enough land in Biafra land for any infrastructure development. Warning against the destruction of businesses and properties belonging to Igbo people in Lagos State, the indigenous people of Biafra said, it is unfortunate that many Yoruba elders are not speaking up against the ethnic attack on Indigo. However, we are urging Yoruba politicians not to destroy Igbo people's properties but give them time to take their property and their movable assets to Igbo land. Continuous destruction of properties of Igbos will provoke unimaginable, unimaginable reactions that Yoruba are not expecting. Don't underrate great Biafrans or you will have yourself to blame. Alaba International Market is an electronic market located in Ojo, Lagos State, Nigeria. It is the largest electronic market in Nigeria. Apart from the sales of electronic products, the market also deals in the repair of home appliances. 
the market and its wide range of businesses activities give opportunities to electronics and electrical engineers who specialize in repair of faulty home appliances to transact businesses and dealers with dealers electronic the market is open on daily basis except on sunday and public holidays the daily businesses the transaction and popularity had attracted new investors and electronics dealers across africa thereby expanding the market in size and population with significant effects of economy of Lagos State. In October 2022, violence clashes broke out of the market. Alaba International Market is a perfect market in which, uh, which no dealer influences the price of the electronic product it buys or sells within the market with no barrier to entry and exit. The market is characterized by huge numbers of sellers and buyers with willingness to buy the product at a certain price based on their need and income, enhancing long-term adjustment to changing in the market condition. In June 2023, it was announced that a number of structural defective buildings would be demolished. The Lagos State Building Control Agency identified 17 buildings as beyond redemption. Taking Nigerian's opinion, Don Blessed Joseph Okoronko said, Everything Mazi in Amdekano predicted about Igbo's doing business in Lagos is happening before our own very eyes. Ismail Ololadi Aisha said, God bless the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Amen. Ejis Kumadu said, You will not know the value of what you have until you lose it. It is a proverb. It is a proverb. Igbo, one day we will go. Odi Kachuku Imane said, The issue is that. Can we stop sit at home because it it affects the economy of Southeast? Can we have good atmosphere to avoid making a rich man a poor man in his own land? Ayomi too said, "It will go if you want. If you wanted, you are doing nothing in Lagos. We have many tribes in Lagos. Your vacation will only give many people chances to succeed." Ubachuk said, "So they can declare sit at home to crumble it again? In as much I advise my people to look eastward." Indigenous people of Biafra just should, indigenous people of Biafra just should just calm down. Stephen Yomi said, "I said earlier that they used write up MOU regards of Kalu and all the cabinet, so that peace will, re- will, be, will remain in Nigeria. Every country is watching us." Gwagwanda Chinedu said, "It is high time they start doing something." Somewhere said, "Somewhere said, I have stayed in Lagos years, and I will know how." x look like in Lagos after Igbo travels. That will be all for now. Please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button. And let us know your thoughts and your opinion via the comment section below. And I will see you on the next news. Bye for now.